Hey everyone, how's everyone doing today? I am doing fantastic. Guess what today is? Ipsy time. Ipsy, ipsy, ipsy time. As usual, I've not gone to the website. I have no idea what is in this bag, but it is heavy today. Um, I actually contemplated on not even putting any makeup on in case I got makeup and I could try it on, but eh, I decided against that because I really don't know what's in this bag. So I don't know if I would have had anything to put on the face. I mean, I, I know I will. I mean, it's oopsie, it's makeup, but you, you know what I mean. All right, so let's see. I think everything is in this bag. Hold the phone. Didn't we get this bag already? This bag looks very familiar. Or did we get one similar to it? I don't know. It's nice though. Oh, it's got little lace on it. Oh, so pretty. I like the color too. Alright, I'm just going to dive in. What is this? <gasps> Ooh, see, I should have just not put any eyeshadow on. Oh man, check it out. Pacifica Beach Crystals natural mineral eyeshadows i think we've gotten pacifica before pretty sure we have um let me just cut this open so we can see what we've got Ooh, i should have see i should have just i should have just uh yes the last one i got from that was an island something wasn't it Oh, you can get this at Ulta. Okay, let's see if this will open this up. Y'all, my hair. Don't even, don't even talk about my hair. I'm trying to let it grow out, and I just dried it naturally, well, yesterday. So, you know, with curly hair, you get what you get. <laughs> yesterday, it was so curly. So, you know... And today, I'm not mess, messed with it much. I've just put it up out of the way. Okay, y'all. See, I don't like doing that. I don't like messing that up, but oh well. Mmm. <gasps> okay, these are interesting colors. They're like a, um, I mean, like, how do they even go together? Oh, my gosh. This is Fort Knox. A, a, a burglar, anybody? Um, around so that they can help me enter this. I mean, how much tape do you need, people? Okay, so we've got these colors. They're all shimmery and shiny. Let's just do swatches. This is like a, ooh, I like the feel of that. It's like a velvet. Okay. Um, it's not very pigmented. I'm not going to tell a fib. I mean, you can barely even see what I'm putting on my hand. Those are the first three colors. We're just going to keep on going. Okay, that's like a lilac purple, purplish color. That, that one's purple. Okay. Well, I don't know. Now it looks like I got a big bruise on my hand. Let's see what this purple looks like. It's like an Easter egg. Hmm. I think if I had darker skin tone... It would be so, so pretty. Um, but you know, I'm pale. So, therefore, I don't know. These colors are just so weird to me. They're like, I don't know. So, there there it is. Oops, wait. Y'all, you know I can't ever do that. Look at that. It looks like I'm going to be, I'm all bruised up. Me. But, you know, I might could use this in my arts and crafts. So, yeah, so I went from this all the way over, so the top color, uh, I don't know, y'all. Like I said, if I had darker skin tone, it probably would be really pretty, but I don't have dark skin tone. And it's not very pigmented either, so I don't know. Like I said, I can probably use it in my arts and crafts. I have a little thing that I'm going to try with that. Okay, where'd the bag go? There it is. Whoa, whoa. Well, shit fire. Oops, sorry. Poop fire. <laughs> okay, oh, I forgot to get the card out. Unzip this month. 
being sexy <laughs> isn't limited to certain size, shape, or age. And it's definitely not about out airbrushing images beyond recognition. It's about confidence. All right. Blah, blah, blah. Ooh. <gasps> Yay. Ooh. It's a double, double, um, brush. That's kind of cool. From Lu Luxie. Oh, man, that is, okay. See, you see this, how this is so tapered? This is how I, I like, because I have one, mine is from Chanel, and it is like raggedy. It's probably 13, 14 years old. It's very old. Um, but I like it when it's tapered like this to do my crease. That is just what I'm used to. So I am so, I'm so glad I got this. I really am. Because I'm telling you, mine is all rattly. I, I've been needing a new one, but they don't make them quite like this anymore. Because you see how thin it is too? And that's how I like it. Now the ones that you're supposed to use, they're like fat. I don't know. It's just, I don't like them. But this, I'm going to dig it. And then you can use that for the lid. Awesome. This definitely... Definitely will get used um, because my Chanel ones are on their last legs. Really, seriously. Okay, what else do I have? Oh, you know what? I have this in my desk because, you know, I am in my craft room. And uh, every now and again, you know, my lips get a little parched. So I do have this, my pink one, in my, um, in my desk. Okay, this is Bubble Macaroon Lip Balm, and it has essential oils in it. Oh, I guess you can get this at Bath & Body. That's what it's saying right there, Bath & Body. It's a uh, right, mm, lemongrass and green tea. I knew I smelled lemon. Let's just see what this is all about. I do like these, though. They really do. Mm-hmm. Moisturize. I like that. I like that taste too. Well, this one's going in my desk as well. So that I can have it. I don't know. I might put that one in my purse. I don't have a lip balm in my purse. My lips get dry. Dry, dry, dry. Okay. Let's see. What else do we got? Okay. Why did I do that? Okay. What is this? Okay, it's so hard to see because of the glare of all the lights. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I think it's a, it is a lipstick. Ugh, and it, it, it's not going to go with me. Did they not read any of my thing? Do I need to go back and update? I mean, y'all, this will not go with my, look, it is so dark. That is not going to get it. It's by Mellow Matte Lip paint like matte liquid lip paint and I'm not crazy about matte at all Tehran is the name of it I mean it's a pretty color I don't know well I've already got lipstick on here let's see let's see if I can't wipe it off <laughs> yeah I'm looking in the viewfinder it's so rude. Um, okay. Who knows, though? I mean, I might could mix it with something. With another one that I have. I don't know. We'll see. I can't really tell on the viewfinder. <laughs> Amanda likes dark. She might like that. I don't know. I mean, it is, it is dark, but on my hand, it looks pretty, but then again, my lips are not this pale. All right, last thing. What is this? This is what was weighing. Oh, I think it's perfume. Y'all, you know, I don't ever really wear perfume. I just wear the Bath and Body Spray. What is this? Wine O'Clock. No, this is going to be Fair No Polish. Fair No Polish. Because it's from Trust Fund Beauty. 
it's going to be fingernail polish. Which I've gone to using gel. Please excuse the finger. I mean, I do craft. You know, that's mainly what I like doing. So I've got ink and everything else on my fingers. Wow. That's a pretty color though. Look at it. Woo! Now, I, I've still not checked out to see if you can put like the gel base and then like regular fingernail polish and then the gel top coat. I'm pretty sure you could do that. You just have to let, I'm guessing, you're going to have to let the fingernail, the re regular fingernail polish dry completely before you put on that top coat because I don't think it's going to work. And of course, putting it under the LED lights, which is what I have, is not going to help you dry regular fingernail polish. But you know what will though? This trick I learned when I was a teenager, so it's been, you know, 150 years ago. And uh, you uh, put them in cold water. And they really do uh, dry fast when you put them in cold water. I don't know why. It just, it is the truth. All right, so that is it. That's all that I got. Let's recap, shall we? Okay, so I got this pretty, I, I do like this color. It's really dark. It's almost black looking, but it's like a cherry red. Well, it's a wine o'clock. I like that. I like that. So that's pretty. Um, the lipstick, which I don't know. We'll see. I got this killer, killer brush. So glad I got this. And then I've got the macaroon. And then uh, the eyeshadow that, excuse me, excuse me so much while I go get it. That fell on the ground. Yeah. Well, well, poo. Anyway, and then I got the eyeshadow, which I really don't, I don't think I will ever use this. Maybe in the crafting world. So be on the lookout for that if you want to know what I'm going to do with it. So that's it in this cute little bag. I could have sworn that we've had a bag like this before. I mean, I use my bags for arts and crafts stuff. Like I put my pens and stuff in it. So I don't know, but it's pretty. But I could have sworn we've gotten one that looked like this before. <laughs> but anyway, I like it. So that's it. That's all the stuff I got from Ipsy this month. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. It's not that much. And let me just tell you, it, and I'm not being sponsored, by the way. Um, it's just $10 a month. And I truly, I mean, I've been doing this for almost a year, I think. Been getting these bags. And I love it. I don't think I will stop. I mean, some months they're like, what are you giving me? But then, you know, being a crafter, like with this eyeshadow, I mean, I can always find uses for stuff. So... And then I also have a daughter. Like, if stuff is too dark for me, she likes, you know, the dark stuff. So I just give it to her for her to have. So, um, but yeah, like, I hadn't had to buy mascara in almost a year because they sometimes they give you the trial mascaras. And so, anytime you can get stuff for free, I say go for it. And some eyeshadows I do use that I've gotten from them. So, but yeah, all right, y'all, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. If you liked the video, yeah, know what to do. All right, y'all. Y'all be good to one another, and I will talk to you later. Bye, y'all.